That is our big story at five. A massive apartment fire in Waukesha believed to have been sparked by a lightning strike. Roughly 100 people are now homeless as a result. Our Brett Lemoyne joining us live tonight at the Hillcrest Apartments with the struggle crews had putting out the flames, Brett. Yeah, and fire crews were out even late this afternoon trying to put out some of those flare ups and you can see behind me now crews are out uh, for a different reason trying to board this place up. Mutual aid and off duty fire crews were called in to help early this morning and you will see in a moment just how bad the damage is from up above. Just after 11 p.m. Thursday, the fire at this Waukesha apartment building burned and burned. It just went up one, two, three. In their initial assessment, investigators say lightning hit the roof during last night's storm, sparking the blaze. I never would have thought, you know, lightning striking our roof and 12 hours later, well, we're sitting here homeless pretty much. CJ Willenzine has lived here for five years. He also does maintenance for the property owner. Willenzine says he saw the lightning hit the roof as he was driving home from work. I just pretty much started banging on the doors. I had my keys. I was opening them up right away and I just said get downstairs, get outside as quick as possible. Firefighters say they were initially called to a building across the street. Fire alarms were blaring, causing some confusion about where it started. Witnesses believe the flames festered in the attic on Shepherd Court for several minutes before shooting up towards the sky. Obviously the building is very unsafe right now. You know, we've got the flare ups that are occurring. The, there's a lot of materials that's overhead that can drop on them. Officials say one person had to be rescued from the third floor. A firefighter was injured and one resident was taken to the hospital. Sky Fox shows whole sections of the roof seemingly ripped off. As residents are let back in for a few minutes at a time to collect valuables, investigators remain hopeful a good portion of the 42 unit building is salvageable. I cannot think of the last time in Waukesha that we've had a, a fire related, a, especially a catastrophic loss like this caused by a lightning strike. Now, investigators say alarms and sprinklers were working. The property has now been turned over to the owner's restoration company. Of course, they will be responsible for letting residents back in uh, to continue to collect some of their belongings. Reporting live in Waukesha, Brett Lemoyne, Fox 6 News. It's amazing everyone's okay, especially sparking in the middle of the night like that. Brett, thank you.